Lord. Man, yesterday, man, yesterday was so pretty out here. But it's springtime. If you don't like weather in Tennessee, just wait a while, let it change. Wait a day. Man, we went from 70s yesterday, beautiful sunshine building that gate, to a freaking rain is moving in. It's just to the west of us. It's going to be here in about, oh, two hours. And it's going to rain all day and all night. And the sun, we ain't going to have no sunshine all week long, I said. It's going to be cloudy and overcast for the next five or six days. So I was glad I was able to get outside and do something. But told everybody the next video would be, what is that concrete structure in Paul Paul's yard? I said, Papa, what is that thing? I've never seen a door on it. Well, I reckon I'll show it to you. I filmed this yesterday. So, as they say on the commercial, roll that beautiful bean footage. <laughs> But I had people say, ask me the other day, said, Papa, what is that concrete block structure? I've never seen a door. Well, let me tell you what that is. I'll go up there and show it to you close up. But that's a concrete roof poured on that. And I formed around there and that concrete flowed all the way down inside them blocks. We poured a good thick eight inch concrete slab first and had rebar all in it and then come up out of that concrete with rebar all the way up into blocks. I think every cell has rebar in it, I'm not sure. And then it's got all kinds of rebar in the roof. And went in there and poured a fo or built a form and we poured concrete right on top and it flowed all the way down in the blocks, those blocks those walls are solid concrete with rebar in them. And the roof is concrete with rebar. And let me walk you around here and show you. What happened is I had a real nice lady renting from me and she was here like six years. But bless her heart, she was scared to death of tornadoes. So I built this right here. Built this tornado shelter. And it ain't going nowhere. I mean, it ain't going nowhere. I can't imagine, I can't imagine moving this thing at the, the uh, equipment it would take to get this up off the ground and on a trailer or something wild. But in here, just for shits and giggles, I have some little tea candles, cigarette lighter and some matches in a mason jar. And if uh, we ever do have to rush in here to get away from a tornado and don't have a flashlight, at least we can have this little tea light candle. That's the only supplies in here other than gasoline. I'm using it to store gasoline and and uh, different oils for the vehicles. And told the wife to bring cardboard out here. Y'all was fussed about my cardboard in the house, so we brought out here to to have ready to put in the garden. And the doors, I want you to notice now, my doors open to the inside. Can you imagine you're in a storm shelter and something gets blown down? and it ends up laying against your door that opens out, you'd never get out. Well, all I did is just bolted a angle iron to the wall and to this makeshift doors, put a bolt in it for a hinge. And I cannot believe how much this steel has rusted out here in a few years. It's crazy. Definitely should have had uh, some good paint on that. But live and learn. Anyway, that's the way this works. So, 
Got a what am I gonna do with my board? Anyway, there's supposed to be a board that goes across, lays right down in here. This side as well. So when you shut it, it don't blow open. <laughs> anyway, uh, there you go. That's what it is, it's a storm shelter. Because, uh, you know, if you watch all my videos, that right there is what's left of a Bartlett pear. That's the one that stained the cars, the trucks. It's also the one that blew down, hit my wife's car, broke a spoiler. Come down. Car never had a dent in it, never been wrecked. Tree slammed down, wrinkled it right there. On the fender right there. Got the spoiler. Tree landed on the back back of that truck. It's a mess. But anyway, that's just part of living in a tornado in, in a tornado alley. Well folks, that's all I've done. That's all, that's it. Ain't doing no more today. Like I said, the rain's gonna come in. What's the next video gonna be? Oh Lord, I don't know. I guess it's gonna have to be something I do indoors. Maybe I'll fix it. Maybe I'll finally put, get them carburetors put on them two, uh, two tools that Mighty Sweet Life give me. Lord, I don't know. I gotta have a cup of coffee. I just wanted to get out here before it started raining. Y'all have a wonderful day and a better tomorrow. Bye, everybody.